waiting for Milgram. Oh, also, we forgot to do that 17 land thing. Meh. Well, it might have been relevant because we added more white cards, but... Yeah. I think this is okay. <clears throat> yeah. I don't want to mulligan with this. We got some good stuff. We'll probably... Really, guy? So yesterday, someone flipped that second turn against me. I mean... That's not... Yeah, but it's very unlikely and sealed. Like... Yeah. <laughs> No, it's unlikely anyway. Like, I don't know why anyone... No, in Constructed, people are playing that, and it's actually good. Well, yeah, in Constructed, where yeah, you play with instants. that's instance. what I'm talking <laughs> about. <laughs> <clears throat> Whatever. Dude likes the one ones. I'm gonna Devil's Play it. Uh, just play an Ironsmith, I guess. Right? I don't want to play a Neonate. Yeah. Unless I actually want to Devil's Play his guy. <laughs> and that's dumpy. No. That's dumpy as all hell. I'll save the neonate for when I want to untap my juggernaut. Still not drawing those instants, huh? That's too bad. I'm sorry to hear that. No sorceries either, huh? That's unfortunate. My condolences. The only thing about this guy that's even marginally threatening is that he's a human. I can't believe he's a human. I was he's tapping him yesterday, and... Just breaking all of the rules? Just for, like, three turns before someone in an adjacent match was like, you know, you can't do that. Yeah. I was like, no, I didn't actually know. Both of you Whoops. are just failing to maintain the game state. Whoops. All of the days. Um, I guess just, just leave wait. up Midnight Haunting. Yeah. He's gonna get cocky and attack with his Delver of Secrets, and I'll trade it with one half of a Midnight Haunting, just in case he reveals a Forbidden Alchemy or a Silent whatever. Silent, uh... Departure. Departure, yeah. Oh, well, he already has a Silent Departure, and it's in his hand, so... It's in his graveyard. Well, it is now in his graveyard. It was in his hand. No, he just... Looked oh. at them. Oh, yeah, Forbidden... I keep forgetting what that card does. Didn't you play it yesterday? Yeah. <laughs> I played two of them. Yeah. I just forgot. Yep, two... No. Not gonna do it. What kind of secrets... Oh, sure. That's All it, right. huh? Okay. What kind of secrets is this guy delving into? All my test animals have died or escaped... So I shall be the final subject. I feel no fear. This is a momentous night. Should we trade a Midnight Haunting final for entry? it? I think so. Like, he's just gonna be a pain in the ass if he turns into, like... Yeah, and also we have a Neonate that yeah. really would like to... Although he could just, like, disrupt this. Which is fine, I guess. Yeah, it's happening. Yeah. Ugh, that sucks. What do we discard? A, uh... I don't want to say Bonds of Faith, but I'm looking at Bonds of Faith. Because, like, next turn we have four mana, we play Juggernaut. The turn after we play Neonate and Ironsmith. I was thinking that next turn we play Neonate. Oh, because he has his guy still. Because he has this guy Maybe still. Maybe we just discard the Neonate. You think? That makes, like, such a good turn, though, with both. And it's something that can untap Juggernaut. Yeah, but, like, if it's just gonna die... I don't know. Also, he has two silent departures in his graveyard. We That's know, why I'm thinking Bonds okay, of Faith is not Okay, we know that he has, like, a 6-9 Trampler in his deck. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But he also has two silent departures in his graveyard. Yeah, then he would have to return them to his hand, and then he has no more guys in his graveyard, and he needs two. Like, so I just feel like... Ain't? Yeah. I All think right. it's greedy to, like, try for that. Alright, well, next turn I'll play... See, like, now we have that turn. <laughs> Alright. Um, if he gets one more mana, he can just start bouncing stuff. I think I just play the two Ironsmiths this turn. That's fine. To be fair, this guy does seem to have a lot of instants and or sorceries. Mm-hmm. 
but he also oh, oh yeah. there it is there it is that's a good thing to reveal yep <laughs> You know what's really interesting is I'm pretty sure he's not going to play a spell Any on spells? his turn. Yeah. Because he wants to leave up Lost in the Mist, and that's going to... Oh, I guess not. No. Okay. Oh. Well, that's what the Bonds of Faith is getting used on. I well, guess. like, your guys are... Oh, it's indestructible, though. Yeah. Do I play Juggernaut or just Bonds of Faith and swing? I could play Bonds of Faith... And Devil's Play, his stupid aberration. He has two cards in hand. One of them is Lost and Mist. I think it's fair to bonds his guy and kill his other guy. That's what I'm thinking is preferable. Because, like, he's just going to have so much trouble dealing with us, like... Especially because these guys turn into giant monsters if he doesn't play anything because he wants to lost and missed our stupid galvanic juggernaut. Yeah. <clears throat> this is actually a really good position to be in because he can only maximize that lost and missed if he makes my guys giant, in which case I'm fine just not playing anything for the rest of the Whenever game. Whenever he's gonna bounce? Oh no. Okay. I'm assuming he would bounce our Juggernaut, like, for several turns. That's fine. Yeah, that is fine. He'll swing for five, bounce our Juggernaut, then we just keep replaying Juggernaut, and his never untaps, because mm -hmm. all he's doing is bouncing. If we get two more lands, we could kill his Juggernaut. Yep. And untap our Juggernaut. Oh, it's a surprise. He has two cards in hand. One of them is a Lost in the Mist, which he'll never get any use out of this entire game. Because he revealed it. <laughs> Three, no. Why are you playing this before you attack? I guess there's nothing you can have. It doesn't matter. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bounce my juggernaut. I'm gonna think about it. That's what he's gonna do. Man, these two ironsmiths have put together such a... Yep, it's happening. Yep. It's just... It's gonna keep going on. Whatever, I'm just gonna do it. This is... Way better. Because he can't stupid counterspell. Yeah. I'm sure it feels awful to have Lost in the Mist in his hand right now. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, I remember when people were telling me, like, and I believe them too, because it's easy to, like, kind of confuse this for Cryptic Command, because it's basically what it is. What do you mean, confuse it with Cryptic Command? Like, in this... What were they telling you? They were saying, like, this is... Like, how could you not, like, want to first pick this? Like, when the, oh, when yeah. the set first came out, yeah. people were valuing this way too highly because they were like, oh, it's Cryptic Command. Mm -hmm. But it's not, and in this f set, like in this format with werewolves, yeah, it's cryptic command is not the same. Well, or at least these modes of cryptic command. I guess. Because like I've run into situations like this a lot, where it's like I want to have mana open for that, but you can really only use this when you're ahead. Yeah, that's the problem. And right now he's not, and he's thinking so many times. Really interesting that he didn't like. I guess he try to untransform your guys <laughs> yeah. at some point. Yeah. I'm gonna deal him a lot of damage. 
You're going to kill him. Is yeah. what's happening. I remember that time. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah. That seems like a poor play. <laughs> I'll just do it for four. Sure. I have won the match? I thought that was just the first game. Oh, the first time he played a bunch of lands. Yeah, he played the Armored Scab, remember? Yeah. Yep. Man, Milgram. Man. Oh, man. We are either going to play against the 81st Zapdos or Ralph Nader. That's exciting. This is going to be a star-studded finale. I wonder who wins in that matchup. I guess we're about to find out. Yeah, Ralph Nader's behind right now, but he's got some tricks. Yeah. He's got some trickery up his sleeve. Maybe some, like, ground attacks? Maybe he's just going to cut down on the use of electricity and render the Zapdos less effective. 